Hello and welcome to my another recording session. This will be vlog number 7 about my progress in Unity 3D creating game. So, let me introduce myself. Who am I? My name is Alexander Lovsky. I am a full stack developer, freelancer. Here you have my contact information, what kind of services I do provide to my clients, software development for the clients' projects, developing customized uh, automatic unit tests, helping companies understand requirements, and I actually help students and people who want to switch into the IT and find a job at the, for the permanent position in German company. So feel free to contact me. That's it for my introduction. Let's start for the main topic. Here you go. Now you will see. Now you see uh, another pretty crucial, important stuff um, from my game. This is a. This is what I got as a result of my day work. And yeah, this is uh, the same game which I have previously showed to you. The same game. This would be another part of the game where a uh, user would see uh, results of his endeavors in the game. So basically, the, this is whole scene uh, was uh, developed to, to show the user how he actually uh, yeah, good in the game, what, what kind of uh, challenges he did, managed and on this monolith, I would have uh, some interactivity stuff presented, uh, achievements, and user would kind of, I don't know, look it and see it and feel proud of on of what about <laughs> he will feel proud uh, on what he achieved in the game which I developed, and yeah, what to add? As you see, this is fully 3D scene. I can like be fast if you don't like I don't know pretty unsatisfied with the uh, movement and here you have ticket boots I think later I will do some funny funny stuff like I don't know buy ticket and uh, see some I don't know animation maybe I don't know <laughs> this would be no micro transactions Definitely, <laughs> but I think uh, there's a certain value in such scene, and it give a, a, a play a kind of relief from the stress in the game. I mean, I don't, I don't, I do not plan to put a game or two the much uh, stress, but it's kind of challenging sometimes, probably. Here you have cars of like I don't know visitors should give you a feeling about that your monument not visit only by you. And there you have observatory, just some simple prop, nothing behind of it. But pretty solid. Kind what kind of challenges did I um, got? Well for example cars are not kind kind of uh, they look cool from the distance but uh, I don't know is that they are too way way too cool for me. Maybe I will ch exchange those cars for something different because I don't know. I just I don't. Uh, as I said earlier in my previous vlogs, I do not use my own assets right now. At the moment, I use freely available and le legally obtainable assets which I can get hold and. Yeah, basically, it looks cool, and it looks it kind of fun was to do that. And things which I need to say about Unity, it's it's kind of if you use um, assets f from like I don't know Unity version eight, you need to know that there are some minor issues. Like I don't know, you need to update scripts and make sure that they are compatible to your Unity version. So, so this is what I actually got as a problem during my uh, time and most times I spend time analyzing the scene like I don't know what things I can do to like like for example you see this floor 
this is kind of interesting asset it should be marble uh, it's like marble street <laughs> but then you have here like I don't know gar garbage pins um, containers you cannot jump uh, I disable this function you don't need to jump in your uh, like uh, glory glory uh, uh, glo glory place like uh, of your glory maybe I will have I don't know advisors put here advisor 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 and you will be able to speak to them get an advice about your current progress of your game it's just not planned but probably would be kind of interesting and what I need to say about other challenges as always a uh, Initial challenge is a conceptual art. I mean, I got to the point that I just create crimes and then go from them and spend time with Unity and trying to have best available, freely available assets. I do not plan to. At some point, I did bought one uh, asset, as I said uh, in the past, but. In this current scene, I don't think that I spent any penny. And I mean, you can always say this is not enough, but I mean, this is what I got, and I am kind of lucky about it that it is working as I expect. You can go there because there are a place reserved for the seller. And if you like what I'm doing, Please uh, hit the bell button, subscribe to my channel, and that is basically it. And it continues. Um, I would p p probably post new update at the end of the week. Uh, maybe, maybe interesting stuff. I don't. I'm not sure. But I see uh, that is slowly but steady going with this project, and I hope. When I pick my schedule uh, like this, I think I will be pretty satisfied at the end because I do not spend too much time at building assets. I spend time to con connect those assets and write mm, game logic. So, yeah, pretty fun, pretty fun today, and that's it. I hope you like it, what you saw, and. Let me know. Let me know what you would like to, what you expect, what you expect from my game, because I do not reveal all of the stuff from my game, but just, uh, just let me say major, major points, and I would repeat: if you like it, hit the bell button, subscribe to the channel, post questions. I'm kind of always uh, happy if somebody comment and give a suggestion. Thank you and. Good luck. Bye-bye.